ClassicGameRoom.com Welcome to Classic Game Room, it's me, Defender, for the Atari 5200 guest hosting Classic Game Room. This is Defender 2 for the Nintendo Entertainment System. Do I detect a bit of Star Wars in there? I like the funky music found here in Defender 2 on the Nintendo Entertainment System. Based on Williams' 1981 arcade sequel to Defender, this is from HAL Laboratory, released in 1988. And HAL is probably best known for the Kirby series, which has little in common with this game. Kirby's a charming, friendly little fellow that's out to make you smile, while Defender 2's mission in life is to make you cry. It's painfully difficult, and Defender fans would have it no other way. You fly around, shoot aliens, and save humans before they're turned into mutants while desperately just trying to stay alive and score some points. It's Defender. No! It's Defender 2. Aw, oh, I just shot the guy I was trying to save. Sorry, he had a family, but, you know, whatever. They're bound to get killed in Robotron later. So, this is pretty much more of the same, except there's a little Stargate you can warp yourself around the screen with. You scored points for destroying enemies and saving humans if you happen to shoot the spacecraft, taking the human away, and then catch the human before they're splattered all over the place. You score big points. But that's, uh, that's risky, because 9 times out of 10 in Defender, you're just going to fly into something and explode. So the more you do to prevent yourself from doing that, the better chance you have of scoring a high score. Ah, oh, I did it again! You know, you should name all of the humans that you accidentally shoot or watch fall to their doom. The last one I accidentally shot was named Polly. He had a cat named Mittens. Rode his bike to his job as a maitre d', and his favorite TV show was Three's Company. Currently, he's vaporized. Let us never forget Polly. And I feel terrible about blowing him up because I could have gotten points. Damn it, Polly. Why were you so stupid to get captured in the first place? I mean, look at that. Because of Polly's incompetence, I was robbed good points that I could have earned. You know what? We don't miss you, Polly. I hope the aliens abduct your cat, too. Anyway, moving on, the NES library is probably best known for big Nintendo games like Super Mario Bros., Metroid, and Zelda, as well as some other popular titles like Mega Man and Contra, but if you look hard enough, there's a lot of great 80s arcade classics available for the Nintendo Entertainment System. Games like this one, Millipede, Dig Dug 2, and Gyrus, just to name a few. Games that weren't really in vogue in the late 80s or early 90s. In fact, Defender 2 is probably more popular now. At that time in history, people wanted colorful platformers and games that took you places. Defender 2 just makes you cry. But it's such a wonderful game and can be found affordably and relatively easily these days. Originally, it was titled Stargate, as seen here for the Atari 2600. No relation to the movie. There's a hard mode and an even harder mode, as well as a two-player option. As you've probably noticed, you have smart bombs that you can use to clear the screen of enemies, and you can even warp around using the Stargate, which may drop you onto some weird Egyptian planet with James Spader. Ah, that, that one? That one was Lucy. Lucy was a stripper, and a good one from what I hear. Currently, she's space dust. Lucy, we shall remember you. Not well. In fact, I already forgot her name. But I do remember Ben from Buffalo, New York sent this game to the show. So thanks once again, Ben, for sending another awesome game to Classic Game Room. May you be abducted by aliens in style. 
Oh, I blew up another one. That one was Al. Al drove a school bus. At least he did until I vaporized him with laser beams. Defender 2 is from famous game developer Eugene Jarvis, known for games like Defender and Robotron. And it's a game that you definitely want in your Nintendo Entertainment System game library. <laughs> 